Hey guys, week seven of core mobility here, Gaz and Andy. What we're gonna kick things off today with is our core part, small little break, and then our mobility part. We're gonna do everything from a side plank position today. So Gary's gonna hop onto the floor, down onto the ground, onto his elbow, or a straight arm. If you wanna make this more difficult, by all means, go locked out elbow. If not, pop it down onto the elbow. Nice, easy start to class. We're gonna go 60 seconds in the side plank, swap it over. 60 seconds on the opposite side in the side plank. We're gonna take a small rest there. When we pop back up, we're gonna go side plank lifts. So that's hips down nice and low to the floor, popping those hips up nice and high. Just hold up to the highest point, Gary. At the highest point of this side lift, I want you to squeeze through that hip on the bottom end. 60 seconds on one side, 60 seconds on the opposite side. We're gonna finish off the core then with 60 seconds of a dumbbell plank pass. Gary's just gonna turn and face the camera for me. Perfect, so hands then into a plank position. Feet are slightly wider than hips here. Hips stay nice and steady the whole way through. You'll see the dumbbell is on the outside of his right hand. He reaches under with his left, places it to the outside, reaches under with his right hand, places it to the outside, and we're gonna work for 60 seconds there. A round is five minutes long in total. We're gonna take a 60 second rest at the end of the round, and we're gonna do four rounds in total, okay? That's it for core. Moving on to mobility next. We're gonna keep our stretching at the very start anyway, a little bit more dynamic than normal. Gary's gonna hop up onto his feet. We're gonna attack the hamstrings today, guys. So Gary's gonna stand with his feet underneath his hips. He's gonna pop down, touch his toes, and he's gonna stand nice and tall. We're gonna move through this for 60 seconds. Just give the guys a side on view there, Gary. You'll notice Gary's keeping his legs nice and straight. He's pushing his hips back behind him here. He's got 60 seconds of those toe taps. We're gonna break off into a dynamic squat hold now. So Gary's gonna hop down into a squat position. He's gonna hook his fingers underneath his toes. Perfect, and from here now, keeping his hands on his feet, he's gonna push his hips nice and high in the air. Again, getting a nice deep stretch into the hamstrings. We're gonna cycle through those reps of so bottom of a squat, hips nice and high, back down into the bottom of a squat for 60 seconds. Once he's finished, he's gonna grab something for a little bit of support. He's gonna stand nice and tall. He's gonna grab something for a little bit of support and he's gonna go for 60 seconds of leg swings on one side and then 60 seconds of leg swings on the opposite side, warming up those hamstrings, getting them nice and loose, trying to push those toes nice and high towards the ceiling. And to finish off then, we're gonna go for a two minute static stretch where Gary's gonna hop down onto the floor, two legs out in front, big reach forward to grab his toes, Two minutes, double hamstring stretch to finish off our mobility session today. That is us for Monday, guys. Best of luck.